How's it going guys, it's Starkiller58 here and welcome back to Battlefront Commander and in this video we are going to quickly go retake the rock asteroids which the Rebellion managed to quickly capture with their damn capital ships. The Rebellion have been really sneaky during this let's play, they've only attacked me twice. This the, um, the first time at Anatol which was unsuccessful and then here which they actually were successful. I think those cap the capital ships, I don't know, how could they have got those capital ships out? Well, probably they went across this route here through Monkal, Raxis, Korriban, Yavin. They must have reached this somehow. But uh, Oh yeah, because they had the wheel beforehand, and then I took the wheel. So uh, yeah, anyways, that's how they probably go out, so we'll probably need to cut them off if the Rebellion proved much of a threat. But anyways, let's just begin this Let's Play by retaking the Rock Asteroids, and I'm setting back the Death Star. I kind of want this fleet to go to the wheel, but I want to time it right so they don't go to the asteroids. Okay. To coordinates. <laughs> Tactical battle imminent. That way our fleet here will get to the wheel and we will have captured this place thanks to the Death Star. Alright, here we are again. Oh wait, I've got a turret still there. Damn, it doesn't show the things in range. Order, sir. Course. Sensors are reporting that there is a hostile presence surrounding the planet. Lay waste to any forces that oppose the Empire. Enemy sighted. We shall let the Death Star do the work. Damn, it has a lot of health. It's not going down easily. There we go. I was worried that the thing might run out before the ship was destroyed. Intercepting. Go after them. Alright, so all the fighters are coming from the blue driver. But can we hold out against the blue driver? We should be able to. So long as our fleet of Star Destroyers can hold out while the Death Star destroys. I'm hit. We should have no more problem from the Rebellion in the asteroids now that we've taken the wheel as well, but they might go to the wheel. Star Taking Destroyer fire. standing by. plan is just to literally hold out. I don't want to keep using the Death Star constantly, but we were very unprepared for the Rebellion's moves. I would like to use the Death Star sometimes. Hey, I have it. It's in my arsenal. Wait, why not use it? I still need to take Uta Power, which I will do without the Death Star and that. I still consider the Mandalorians as the primary threat. The Rebellion still hasn't done much, even though their force here was massive. Man, it's like they know not to bring in the cruisers. Ready for command, sir. It really is like they know not to bring in the cruisers, they just bring in the fighters. Smart of them, I would say. I'm on this one. Watch your back. More enemy crowd. Feels weird watching the Star Destroyers inside the Death Star, as well as these asteroids too. Taking 
Engines are malfunctioning. There's the blue driver. Primary ignition. Where'd he go? I got it. Under control. Takes care of that one. Shields almost gone. I've got him. The blue drivers is what's calling in all these fighters. At least they will all be destroyed. I have enough for Tartan Cruiser. Wait, where's the other one? Yeah, I have. Where's the other one? Oh, it's back there, actually. I'll bring it forward just a little bit. Where's that blue drop? It looks like it's heading this way. We are keeping them at bay, but there is a lot of fighters. Star must be cleared to fire upon the last vessel if it is the last one. I want to send in a victory cruiser. Less valuable than a Star Destroyer here. Damn, it has two hangers, so yeah. No way, it has three hangers. That takes care of the cruisers. Pull the Victory Star Destroyer back. Fall in with the defensive line. Now I think it's just a matter of clearing up the fighters when we can. But they'll soon fall without cruiser support. Hopefully, slowly mop them up. There, just look at all that. That's, just look at that light show there. Those green and blue and red lasers. Gone. Cover me now. Uh, one. 
Yep, their fighters are slowly closing up, but they took out one of our Tartan cruisers. See that dogfighter action going on? It's hard to see. Damn, that Death Star is right to us. It's technically already in it. Alright, now it's just a matter of cleaning up the fighters. I believe that's all that's left. I know that there was more than those three cruisers there. So I'm guessing the rest are just the fighters that they produce at their stations. Wait, we're losing fighters. And our Titan cruise is down. Damn. What type of fighter could they have left as part of the unit? Why aren't they retreating yet? Do they really think that they can win? There we go. They've actually taken out most of our fighters. We can't produce, seem to produce anymore. If they had bombers, then they could have actually just still destroyed our fleet with just what they had left. It's very best not to underestimate the rebellion here. System control achieved. We have regained control of the rock asteroids. Tactical God damn it! I knew that they would do it. God damn it! And I didn't have my fleet in time. System lost. Tactical battle imminent. They'll pay for this, and I know where shit to target now. Blue driver. Blue driver is destroyed. It must be destroyed first. Sensors are reporting that there is a hostile presence surrounding the planet. Lay waste to any forces that oppose the Empire. Squadron reporting. Awaiting your command. Enemy sighted. Ready for orders. Engines activated. Your command, sir. Man, that thing has advanced shields. Powerful enough Come to even withstand then. the Death Star. I don't know if I want to send my ready. bombers against it. Sir, Actually, target the shield. Take down their shields. Roger that. Commencing attack run. Reporting in. Roger that. Form up. Destroyer here. Form up. Changing course to intercept. I've got him. Ah. Christ, it's going to take ages to even bring down the shield, position. apparently. Order confirmed. Unable to destroy the shield. Closing on target. Intercepting. I copy. I have them now. Reporting. Oh, no, you He will be a commander. We've got them on scopes. Pursuing enemy Attack forces. Commencing. Nowhere to run. Falling out of formation. Taking them out. Blue drivers' hangers are Don't down. Attack. There's no hangar actually on that destroyer. Star destroyer standing by. Fire. Star destroyer reporting in. Open Enemies fire. In Shields are down Ready to on the destroyer orders. as well. Target, Target, the Target the engine so that they do not escape. That battle was well, a battle cruiser. Yes, that battle cruiser has tough armor and shields. Your command, sir. I've got them in my sight. Commander. Move in. Draw their fire. Uh, Reporting in. Roger that. Roger that. Copy. Target. Warm up. Attack. Keep eight. concentrating firepower on them.
Those vessels must be coming from Mon Calamari at least. They'll definitely have to go to the wheel in order to try and fight us again. Damn, it's still ripping apart my Star Destroyer over there. Oh, they're retreating, I didn't realise. Well, the, boat, the blue drive... What? How can the blue driver retreat? I destroyed its engines! I destroyed its engines, though. It shouldn't have been able to retreat. You saw me. I s you saw me, guys. I swear I destroyed his engines, right? Alright, anyways, we must prepare for our next plans. Alright, I've decided that I want to do the gunship raid with Uta Power. I need to see how strong the ground defences are because there is a level 5 station here. And I'm pretty sure that they'll have a massive fleet above Uta Power sending it as they were cut off. So this is mainly to see if we can capture the planet. Then hurrah, and then we can complete. knock out the station. Invasion but if not, commencing. oh crud, they've got a lot. I've got a huge ground force down there as well. So I most likely will need this full support. And, hmm. Let's see what they have down there then. Weapons loaded. Rebels are blatantly making their presence known in the streets. Deploying some troops on the surface should remove any traitorous thoughts from their heads. The sinkhole will give us great cover for the gunships. Copy. Your orders? Enemy sighted. Roger that. Form up. Abandoned sensor array is up here. Entering battlefield. The sensor array was serviced greatly, sir. so I think we should I capture copy. that. Reporting. Yes, sir. Let's capture the sensor array. Yes, command. And let's see what we're dealing with on the ground. Ready. Weapons loaded. No structure here. Target. Sometimes there might be. No. Okay. Pirate skiff here. We've secured an abandoned sensor Copy. array. Your orders. What are we dealing with? Whoa! Big base. All vehicles, actually. That's not good. Roger that. Where's my other thing? Form up. I don't have any access to our bombers Bombing either, order. it seems. Awaiting orders. I copy, sir. Engaging Let's see if we target. can destroy that consortium factory here. Ready. Actually, if it's all vehicles, then they shouldn't be able to recapture the abandoned sensor okay. already, right? I copy. Reporting. Yes, sir. Yes, Commander. Oh, here comes all the vehicles. Ready. That, for some reason, actually can't hear us if we're in the sinkhole. This Wait sinkhole is giving us great cover. Yeah, they can't hit us if we're in the sinkhole. Oh, they can destroy the sensor array, though. Okay, that's something I didn't account on for. Pirate skip here. Spearheading us. 
Now look at this, they can't hit us. Oh yeah, but now you move, you fools, just because the tank went away. Commence assault. Roger that. Ready for attack. Can I hit them there? Yeah, I can. That's good. I was about to say, you fools, why did you go chase the tank? The tank went away, lowering my gunships out. Clever. This sinkhole is great to cover. Attack! Fire! Open fire! Attack that target! Awaiting orders. Well, they destroyed the sensor array, so I don't know what now. us when we're in the sinkhole. That's really weird. I mean they are shooting at us but it's not taking the health down. Haha, <laughs> great cover for the gunships. Although we can't get close to the enemy main base without them shooting at us I think. Well, we should take down as many vehicles as we can. Ready for attack. Target locked. Especially those Kadelby tanks. Or Candorous assault tanks, Attack. my bad. Where am I getting Kadelby tanks from? Oh wait, we're taking fire here, I don't know what from. I copy. Oh shit, I moved them. I moved them, that's Reporting. not good. Yes, sir. Back into the sinkhole, back into the sinkhole. Yes, Commander. Ready. Don't go that Weapon way, I told you to go backwards, you fool. Skip ready. Open fire! Attack that target! Man, I love it when those flank tanks go boom. Pirate skip here. Copy. Your orders? Roger that. Form up. Awaiting orders. Attacking target. Fire at will. Must have done a great deal of damage to their land forces. It'll make way for our main invasion force to be much easier, I'll say that much. Attacking. Look at those gorgeous mountains. <laughs> Reporting. What's it looking at? Those gunships. With a nice scenery there for once. Vehicles just sitting in that sinkhole. That would be pretty Firing. funny. Yes, Commander. Ready. Stick to the mountainside. Stick to the mountainside. Weapons loaded. That sinkhole and that sensor array was really good for us. So funny. Skip 
Target. Pirate skip here. Copy. All right, Your now orders? to the palace. Entering battlefield. Which might take a while. Because for some reason we've got to destroy these hard points before the palace itself takes whole damage. Oh wait, there were still vehicles lying around. Engaging target. Where were they the whole time? Yeah, where were you the whole time when I was blowing up your base? Ah, oh, that's not good. Roger that. Ah, uh, there's quite a lot, quite a lot. Awaiting orders. I copy, sir. I copy. Reporting. Yes, sir. Spearheading assault. Yes, commander. Move, they're firing. God damn it. Ready. Maybe we can load them back to the sinkhole. Weapons loaded. Let's see how that goes. Skip ready. Give me a target. It would be coming Pirates from this direction here. here, I think. Copy. I guess Your they're smart orders. enough not to follow us into the sinkhole then. Roger that. Commence Again, it's assault. just in our best interest to take out as much of them as we can, I guess. Awaiting orders. I copy, sir. I copy. Or maybe we can load Ready back. For attack. Target locked. Reporting. Yes, sir. Oh, they still can't hit us in a sinkhole. What an amazing advantage we have. Open fire! Attack that target! Attacking target! Fire at will! Yes, Commander. Oh wait, is that two ships? Ready. Oh no, there's one. It looked like two. Second there. Alright, that takes care Escape of ready. those reinforcements. Thank God just for the Give sinkhole, that's just amazing for us. Nevertheless, we should still keep an eye out for any other remaining forces that would have been across the map. All right, the palace is down. So is there ever remaining structures? What could they possibly have left? All right, here we go. The map is revealed to us. So what do they have left? A couple of guys walking around here, and a couple of guys just walking around there. See, that's what happens when they don't have many land troops. They only have one anti-air as well. Yes, this was hugely in our favour, mainly because of the sinkhole and the fact sir. that they didn't have much anti-air. Well, because they didn't have any infantry to build on the pads. So this was a huge advantage to us. Normally, if it wasn't for that sinkhole, the lack of anti-air, we definitely would not have succeeded. It's just a matter of a chase now. Dun dun dun. I copy. We are victorious. That was good. That was very, very good. That's what they had on the ground. So again, very strong ground force, but Planetary control the lack achieved. of anti air did it. Now oh, that's only had for ships as well, Beginning I didn't realize. Construction. At 
last. Corruption is finally removed from this sector, apart from Bespin. Let's clear out those space forces. Tactical battle imminent. Ah, they stand. So little chance. Oh, and you I have an interdictor. This pitiful force is preventing our assault on this system. Dispatch them so that we can secure orbit for the Empire. Transmit orders. Oh, and I have a Star Destroyer as well in the reinforcement queue. I think sending one Star Destroyer would do. I copy. They don't have any fighters. A waste. I copy. Coming around. Reporting. Heading to destination. Yeah, the one star destroyer will be enough to take them out. Star destroyer standing by. So yeah, let's just watch this go down against these two ships here. Zoom in any further using this camp? Nope. Okay, well that ships are definitely about to go down. There we go. Now for the last ship, which definitely cannot retreat in any way. Just look at the fleet just to back there watching. Oh man. Oh dear. The enemy has been defeated. Just like that. Taking a while to end though. Jesus. There we go. Alright, now, Utapau is under our control. Now, that's going to be the end for this video, guys. I don't know if the next video I want to take control of Bespin, or actually start to, to deal a crippling blow to the Mandalorians and push them out of this sector, saying it's only two planets. Mandalore, their core world. But I'm going to assume it's heavily defended and all their heroes are on the ground because that's where they usually spawn. So Mandalore will be tough to conquer. So I think it would probably be in our best recommendation to capture a forward planet, Taurus. As well because the ground force, ground units in this mod travel very slowly across hyperspace. So we will need a forward base if we are to quickly take Mandalore. So Taurus will need to be captured first cut off their other reinforcements as well. Maybe then we can go for Dathomir as well. But that would leave literally leave the Mandalorians here and down here, which is where their primary force is at. So who knows? Maybe we'll capture Bespin first or Taurus or Mandalore. Let me know what you guys think. What should we go for first? Should we finish up on Bespin or finish up on these worlds? Leaving the Mandalorians to these worlds here, which we'll probably do afterwards. And uh, then the main force, which, which we will literally have boxed in. So let me know in the comments below what you want to see next. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in that next video. May the force be with you. Oh, excuse me. Goodbye.